So one uh, research project that I am still working on that I think is uh, pretty exciting and potentially has some uh, important real world impacts uh, is my research on the Obama effect. Uh, so I have a book out by the same name uh, and in the book my co-author and I find that uh, exposure to President Obama's 2008 presidential campaign helped to reduce white racial prejudice, uh, at least temporarily. Uh, and in some more recent uh, follow-up research, I'm finding the same thing for the 2012 campaign. Um, and what this suggests is uh, a couple of things that I think are important, uh, potentially, uh, beyond the ivory tower. Uh, one is that uh, prejudice, though, it's this very stubborn attitude, uh, that it's this uh, perceptual lens through which people uh, you know, stereotype other people and treat people poorly, uh, can nevertheless uh, still be reduced uh, through something as simple as exposure to uh, a counter-stereotypical portrayal of someone in the media. Uh, so simply uh, watching the campaign of President Obama, just seeing him and his beautiful family countering racial stereotypes uh, can help to reduce people's own racial stereotypes. Um, and this is helpful for a couple of reasons. Um, right, we spend uh, a huge amount of money worldwide every year trying to reduce prejudice, uh, but often with only hunches uh, about how to do it well. Uh, and this research suggests that something as simple as um, positive exemplars of outgroups uh, would be very helpful. Um, so if we have media campaigns, public information campaigns, where we simply expose people uh, to individuals from other groups um, who counter their stereotypes, uh, that can have some beneficial effects. Uh, and it's also helpful, right, when we just think about critiques of the media. Uh, everyone's always talking about how the media uh, is doing things badly. Um, but often, right, everyone still is disagreeing about the ways in which they're doing things badly uh, and what should be done to make it better. Uh, and so when organizations that are lobbying the media to change their portrayals, they might not be able to point to some research and say, hey, uh, we now have research that pretty clearly shows what a good portrayal would be. Um, and that's what we want uh, portrayals to look like in the future. Uh, and that might help nudge things in a positive direction.